at the Imaging Research Center, we uh, do research using magnetic resonance imaging, uh, primarily to image the function and structure of the brain to try to understand both how the brain works in its normal state and how it stops working in various types of disorders, such as psychiatric or neurological disorders. One of the really interesting things for us was starting to study 3D perception uh, in a dynamic world. With MRI, we can put anyone into an MRI scanner and watch their brain as they engage in mental tasks. We actually had to build a custom apparatus so that subjects could view 3D dynamic movies while lying in an MRI scanner. One of the most surprising uh, results that we had uh, was, was really just where the hub of 3D motion processing seems to be in the brain. Uh, our research uh, over and over again in a series of experiments really showed that this area we'd long thought to be involved solely in two-dimensional processing was, was also the key player in 3D motion perception. What we really want to do is build the center to become a resource for uh, you know, a broad range of research across campus. Right now the center is focused on brain research and brain imaging. Um, what we'd like to do is expand it out so that a much broader range of researchers could get involved. In the next year and a half we'll be moving to the uh, Norman Hackerman building uh, right in the middle of the UT campus and one thing that'll do is provide us with additional space where we can add uh, different imaging techniques that'll again let us really broaden the scope of the imaging that's going on at the UT campus.